Hey guys, what is up? It is me again, Nintendo Console Gamer. And I felt like doing a weird intro for... Well, I mean, my intro is normally weird, but whatever. Um, what you're seeing right now is a 10 and 0 killing override gameplay on Crash Site with four ASE captures. So it was a pretty crazy game. Um, and it was pretty awesome. So... Yeah, basically I was trying to unlock Supercharger on my clan account and I ended up succeeding since I only needed two more and I ended up getting four, but these guys weren't really into it at all. But the topic I have today has something to do with the gameplay, but not that much. Uh, basically what I'm going to talk about is objective game modes in competitive and what I think of that. So basically, I would be very, very happy. Uh, and this guy just goes to, yeah, he just sits in the invincibility spot all game. But I would be very, very happy if uh, objective modes were included in Conduit 2. And, well, not Conduit 2, Conduit 2 competitive. Um, because I feel like they add a whole new level of strategy to the game. And I think something that clans, teams haven't emphasized enough is communication. Because it seems like it seems like most of the time they don't have their headsets plugged in or anything. I don't even have one, but I mean, I'm thinking about getting one. But, um, but either way, I mean, it would make it, it would bring a whole new level of strategy. And... Personally, I think Killing Override would be a perfect fit because it's like Team Deathmatch and Capture the Flag all mixed into one. Um, so that way you don't need Team Deathmatch or Capture the Flag separately. And so basically, for three game series, is basically what I'd be, what I, I guess I would love to see. I mean, course I don't know how any of you guys feel about this probably this would probably suck to most of you but I don't know for me I just think this would be awesome it would be like shared like a mix of shared stock killing override and annexation it would be like amazing for competitive like you have no idea um it, like because it would be so strategic and so intense and so much fun I mean I did get sort of my first taste of competitive. I was playing with a bunch of good players who are um, also involved in clans and all that. Let's see, that would be yesterday. Um, and I ended up going... Well, the first game I went 12-3, and three, which was pretty ridiculous. But um, other than that, I went positive by one once and went negative by two or three a couple times. But, I mean... I was alright, my connection was also very, very bad, it was 4v4 and all that, but it was really fun and really intense, so I think with objective modes it would just crank it all up to 11 uh, or 10.87, but still, I mean, I love objective game modes, even in public matches, they're really intense and really awesome, and so, I mean, it would just be so much cooler even in competitive play where everyone actually knows what they're doing, everyone's trying hard for it. And everyone's just trying to get the W. I think it would also show um, how multifaceted the clans are. Like, if you're not just good... Because, like, some clans might only be good at one thing, and that's not good. Like, it would show, I guess, it would show who the well-rounded teams are. And then it would show who the just plain slayers are. Of course, slaying has has a big part to do a huge part to do in objective play anyway, um, because it's really important um, to kill the other team so you can uh, take the objective or, you know, pull the ASC or whatever it is that you're trying, whatever game mode, whatever you're trying to do, whatever you're trying to accomplish in that particular game type. It's really important to have good slayers so you can accomplish that. So, tell me, guys... The, blah, 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 blah. Guys, um, tell me what you think in the comments below. Do you think this should happen or not? Um, 
Personally, I think it would be awesome, but I think I'm one of probably the only ones who really cares about objective play that much. However, I think it could really, really, um, I think it could really improve uh, and enrich the uh, the competitive scene. So tell me, guys, tell me what you guys think in the comments below. I'm going to sign out right now, leaving you with two minutes or so left in the gameplay. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.